I mean, you know, when, when Dylan was calling me about players, I mean, we have a conversation, you know, and um, based upon, you know, how one another feel, we, we either move forward um, or we don't. And everybody that calls me, you know, I, I love, you know, um, you know, it's not about having the most talent, you know, this guy average this and that. Um, it's about what he can bring to the table to help our team. And all these guys bring something to the table. Um, you know, we want to be kind of like Boston was last year, not having a lot of talent, but them guys play hard. And that's how they were to win games. And uh, you know, that, that's what we want. Um, and we're going to, we're going to, that's what we brought in. And that's what we're looking forward to. Okay. And I had a uh, three season when I made the three house on it. Yeah. We got to get that. I'm sorry. I, <laughs> um, I mean, it's an urge. I mean, all, all of us is, it's nothing like, you know, playoff atmosphere. And uh, when it was here, um, Golden State was nice. But when it was here, it, you you get chills, you know, and um, you know, I'm eager to get back to that that position. Um, the whole team and the organization is, the city is, and um, that's what we're preparing for right now and uh, preparing, been preparing for all summer. Um, it's going to be the same, the same system, you know, uh, same philosophy. Um, you know, it, it's just different faces. And we brought guys in who feel like they're going to fit that philosophy and our system. and. Um, the guy that we brought in uh, want to be a part of this. So um, it's always good to have guys who, who are all on the same page. For me, it was just because um, I didn't finish out the season. And so um, this all season was big to get back on the floor. Um, where some of our guys was, you know, wanting to improve their game. Mine was, I kind of be ready before you know, the first, first game. Um, and I'm, I'm, I'm ready. So, um, and then from there, um, we're standing the entire season. You know, without missing game. Now, stuff happens. You know, you can't control what happens, but um, stuff that I can't control, I want to control. And, um, you know, I think uh, my doctors, my trainers have done a great job of helping me get back to that point. And, you know, I feel like I can withstand an 82 game season right now. What was your reaction when you heard the news? Uh, it was tough. I mean, I, I didn't believe it. Drew told me. And, I mean, at that time, you don't know what to say. Um, you know, one of our brothers had. Is going through a situation right now, and you know, all we can do is be there for him. And it actually just made our unit a lot stronger. Um, some of us went up there to, to see him, um, you know, worked out a little bit with him. So, um, you know, they just be God to what we're trying to accomplish this year. And um, we always pray for him, we always in his corner. And he knows if he needs anything, he can always call any of us. Um, but uh, no, it was just good to see, you know, a smile on his face. You know, had, the baby, she had a baby girl, so she's doing fine. Um, and now it's time to, you know, to get Lauren back on track. With you two guys being, I think we both mm -hmm. in who, who wants to be and wants to play, who wants to play hard, you know, who wants to win. As far as Terrence, um, you know, I always love Terrence's game. You know, he, he can score, he plays hard, he defends, rebounds, and of course we all know you got to win a mentality, right? So, no, too much. <laughs> so. Um, no, it's good to have one of your guys who, who you went to war with uh, come back and play with you. And, um, you know, he's excited to be here. And, and all of our guys are excited to be here. And we are the greatest work. Have you ever done before? For sure. Like starting um, at the ground in 2012 and building it up? For sure. Um, that, that's, uh, if I'm not here for that reason, then I should be here. I mean, that's, that's my my goal coming into every year, um, trying to put a banner up. Um, but we know it starts. It, it doesn't happen overnight. You know, we got to start somewhere. and. Uh, we were getting to that point, and then injuries occurred. So now we kind of got to start kind of not all the way over, but, you know, get back on track. And so um, I think this year is going to get us back on track, you know, to, to keep moving forward. And what our ultimate goal is is to um, win championship. Oh, well, I love it here. I don't plan on leaving. So um, I guess I'm in that old school category where um, I try to win it. Um, win it here where I started my career. Um, that's always been a goal of mine. I never thought about leaving here, you know, so, um, you know, but I mean, people have their own, you know, opinions and their own you know, decisions, you know, and reasons why they're making decisions, but, and I have mine. So um, I, I love it here, and um, my goal is to bring a championship here. And so I had to make a decision to, you know, not play through it and try to get healthy so I can come back in and make this team access more make this team successful as possible. How do you feel physically in light of the surgery and like 
Are you limited at all on the court? Uh, no, I feel fine. Um, ready to go going in tomorrow. Um, of course, they're going to um, limit me a little bit. They don't want to overdo it. But as far as practices or um, training camp, all that, two a day, I'm, I'm all in. You have to kind of pinch yourself and say, hey, I've only been in the league four years. I'm talking about it in my fifth media day. And I'm like, <laughs> and I'm like man, I'm getting old. <laughs> five years. So um, it flies by so quick. And when you get drafted, you know, people say, Enjoy it because it goes out so quick, but uh, that's a cliche. I mean, everybody says that. And then, and then next thing you look up, and you might be five years in. So um, it definitely goes by fast. And I try to stress that to Buddy and Chet. And, I mean, I'm only, I'm young, they're the same age as me, but um, try to tell me it goes by very fast. You're going to be the ambassador for the city of New Orleans for the second time in your career at the All Star game. How big is that for you? And also, since having missed it last year, um, getting back to that place. Also? Yeah. I think when I played on the parent, did he take it? I'm thinking of all, I was thinking of first team on it. Man, I'm sorry. Um, I'm having a day, man. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, first team on the Wrong day, first first wrong day. Yeah. Um, Forgive um, me, man. I'm, I'm having a day. Yeah, all star, all star is fun. I mean, in 14, it was, it was an amazing time. I had an amazing time. Um, so I know it's going to be even better you know, this year. Um, and back to the all uh, NBA team, um, you know, it, it still happens. I mean, nothing I can do about it now, you know, but focus on this year. So, um, you know, my goal is to just, you know, do what I got to do to help this team win and let that stuff again take care of itself. Um, that's not my focus to come in and say, well, you know, my goal coming to this year is I'm not sharing the ball because I want to win MVP. I want to, that's not me. I mean, everybody who's been here, Know, covering the project, no on the team guy. So I let that stuff take care of itself if it happens. If it, happens. If it don't, then so be it. Uh, yeah, I definitely help my game. Um, but whatever coach wants, man, I don't, I don't, I don't really care. I don't even win. You know, if he wants me, I will say something to bitch, but that's not going to happen. But <laughs> no, I mean, but if he wants, whatever he wants me to do, and, and that's the good thing about our team, everybody feels that way. Whatever coach wants us to do, um, we know he has, he has his. He has our best interest at heart, and um, he has his team's best interest at heart to help us win. So whatever he needs to needs to be done from any guy on the team, um, we're going to definitely do it. I'm um, very comfortable. Um, I think you know you just have to you have to just go through it. Um, you know, I think when I first got here, um, God, all right, you're the guy. I'm like, only 19 years old, you know, as a rookie. So um, it was tough, and that's how you know. Got more and more mature, you know. Got older and uh, got more years in the league. It started to get easier and easier. Um, Good start realizing well, these guys really are going to listen to you. They are going to follow. So um, now it's I'm very comfortable. Um, and it's a two way street with anybody on the team. I can come and say something. I remember my first year. I mean, Tim's first game here in New Orleans. Uh, something happened. I wasn't playing, but I was I was mad we were losing. And Tim just looked at me like, "Ad, you going to say something?" I'm like, oh. I wasn't expecting to, you know, say that, but it's sure that these guys look up, you know, and look forward to me saying stuff, you know, because they want to follow, they want to, they want to be a part of something special. So, um, you know, that just, I'll always remember that, you know, and just, all right, all right, well, these guys want to follow you, so um, you have to leave. What does he like into those roles? Um, well, Father Time is undefeated, you know, so, um, you know, them guys had tremendous careers, multiple championships, MVPs. Um, you name it, and um, soon enough, <laughs> that'll be me and somebody, you know, in seventh grade right now will be sitting right here, so. Um, but when you have tremendous careers like they do, um, you can go over the bank. Kobe went out for 60, you know, 61. I mean, he and made a Tim, you know, uh, tremendous career, you know, and it's always fun to watch them guys play and to have an opportunity to play against them guys. Um, for several years, um, you know, watching on TV and you know, I want to play against Kobe, I want to play against Tim, uh, KG, all these guys. And now um, you play against them, now they're leaving the game and basically handing the torch off to everybody else in, uh, in the league and, you know, showing us the road to, to be successful like they was. Great. Thanks.